Hello everybody, welcome back to another trip report. Today I am here in Brussels and I'm going to be heading over to Newark with United Airlines on the 777 er in uh, Economy Plus. We just got past uh, security here in Brussels, we're now going to head to um, Passport Control and then head to our gate. It should be, pre should be a pretty fun flight over to Newark, it's going to be around uh, seven and a half hours and um, uh, in Economy Plus, so yeah, it should be a pretty fun flight. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoy the rest of the video. The aircraft flying me over to Newark is November 2333 Uniform, a United 777 3 delivered to the airline in February 2017. Once I reached my gate, I was informed that I was upgraded to United's Polaris Business Class for this flight. Let's start with a quick tour of the Polaris seat. In front of us is a large monitor for the in-flight entertainment. Underneath it is a small area for storage and the tray table which folds out like this. Next to the window are the seat controls. On the other side there are some power outlets and a remote for the IFE. There's also a little cabinet with a bottle of water and the headphones inside. There's a reading light over here and another light next to the aisle. Down next to the seat is a literature pocket with the safety card and the in-flight magazine. The seat itself is very comfortable and has an adjustable headrest along with a shoulder harness to be worn for taxi takeoff and landing. When I arrived at my seat, I found a large pillow, a blanket, and yet another pillow. We pushed back from gate Bravo 11 around 15 minutes behind schedule. We took off from runway 25 right in Brussels around 30 minutes after our scheduled departure time.
Once we reached our initial cruising altitude of 30,000 feet, the cabin crew handed out some warm nuts. Around 10 minutes later, lunch was brought out. I had some chicken with a vegetable cake, a cauliflower salad, and a roll. Dessert was a vanilla ice cream with some chocolate on top. United's 22 777 3 ers have 60 Polaris seats in a 1 2 1 configuration. In the space next to the second row of exits near the L2 and R2 doors, you can find some in flight snacks and beverages. Let's have a look at United's amenity kit. This one is made as a partnership with the suitcase company Away. It has a bag of facial products, toothpaste and toothbrush, earplugs, an eye mask, this little card, a pen, tissues, and socks. Before beginning the descent, a second meal service was brought out. It was a burger with some fruit and a brownie. We began descending towards Newark via the Flow C4 arrival. Landed on runway 22 left in Newark around 15 minutes early with a flight time of 7 hours and 19 minutes cruising at 34,000 feet. 